What is up Team Tierra B? If you're new here, go ahead and subscribe. I'm Tierra B and I'm just doing me. And in today's video, as you can see by the title, this is part two to my wash day. Um, earlier, I had uh, washed my hair, I deep conditioned it, and I tried a new product. I used the um, soap for my uh, wash day from Natural Way Occulty. Um, I also did a demonstration and review on her growth oil. And yeah, so I'm just moving right along with this day. I'm excited. Um, I blow dried my hair with the Kiss blow dryer with the attachment. Check out the previous video if you missed it. It was really good. So now what we're doing is we're gonna go ahead and continue on with the silk press. So my hair has been separated already into one section, two section, and we're gonna go ahead and put the fourth section here. Typically my hair does not go into four sections this easily like I usually have to do like Six to eight sections to get my hair to be able to behave the way I want it to but because it has been blow-dried and Fully detangled I can go ahead and get away with four sections. So that makes me really excited So I'm gonna go ahead on with this process. We'll leave that there leave my two space buns here <laughs> and we're gonna go on and jump into this silk press um, I got my hair silk pressed about a year ago today and i am going to do it myself this year because um last year the young lady did a really good job but she cut off too much of my hair and so i worked too hard this year to grow these inches for somebody to just cut it off because they felt like it right so anywho let's go ahead and get it done i am going to put some music on for you guys and we're just going to enjoy this together thank you for being here on this natural hair growth journey with me yes i'll let you guys go ahead and watch um before i do that i'll show you what i am flat ironing with this is the love luv flat iron and i've had this for uh probably i've probably had this about a year and a half but i have not used it on my own hair i used it on my son's hair before um because it, he does the the twist you know <laughs> and but i haven't used it on mine so i'm i'm excited for this whole process so let's jump into it um my hair is thick thin like i have thin strands but i also have a lot of those thin strands so i'm just going to kind of test it and see what my hair needs this should help me keep it detangled along the way okay and i'm gonna attempt to do the chase method it's kind of hard to do it by yourself but we shall see i'm gonna start off by trying to use this with the finest teeth of the comb so let's see how this is gonna go Okay, I want to make sure I got the right temperature right now. It's pretty high. It's on 420. I'm going to bring it down a little bit just because I don't know how much heat my hair can really take right now. So I'm bring it down to about 400. So let me just try it without the chase method first. <laughs> so this part of my hair seems to be behaving very well it's extremely soft and it seems to be cooperating very well with the flat iron so that was one pass i'm going to try my best not to do more than two passes so i'm going to go ahead and do one more pass for this one without the chase method again very nice yeah guys so i think we're good to go there we'll see if i have to change the method as i go so now i'll put the music and we're just gonna go ahead and run with it here we go
bright you guys so I wanted to just jump back in really quick and show you guys that this section is completely done um, I actually was prepared because I knew that um, after a year I was gonna need to be cutting my ends but look at that you guys I got some pretty good length there um, I am going to clip my ends myself I got my shears here and this may not be the best way to clip your ends but I'm just doing me so do what, what's best for you but I'm just gonna go ahead while I have it here and just do the best I can with what I have so I'm using my mirror so I'm gonna just bring this forward so I can see what I need to cut and just go for it Bye bye, split ends. There we go. So, not much. Maybe it was a half an inch. Uh, maybe you need to cut even just a little bit more. I'll lift and check as well. I'm not a professional, so don't come for me in the comments, y'all. <laughs> looking better already it's funny all the hair I had in this section before it was straight now it seems like it's not that much hair <laughs> gotta love natural hair So that was pretty simple. I am going to go ahead and finish this side and I will check back in with you guys. So bear with me as I get back into position here. Alright you guys, I am done with the whole left side. Look at that. She's looking pretty good. Uh-huh. I did have to go in and clip my ends a bit on this side as well. Um, she had a lot of split ends. Not I mean not too bad, honestly, not too bad for you know a whole year since I straightened it. But, you know, I did go in and, you know, try to even it out as best as I could. Um, that's obviously probably still some work that could be done. But, you know, for the sake of this video, <laughs> we'll go ahead and leave it alone. Uh, and I'm going to jump in to the other side. So, yeah. So, that is that side straighten. i give you guys a quick little before and after. with this <laughs> you can see the difference between flat ironed and just blow dry so definitely a big difference for sure but okay guys I'm gonna go ahead and get this side done and I will be back with my final thoughts stay tuned all right you guys so this is it this is my full head completely flat ironed and pressed out um i did what i could um as far as trying to just kind of even everything out on my own i'm pretty sure the back could use some work um but i will let you see
probably got it's probably longer over here than it is over here um it's also straighter over here than it is over here for some reason so um definitely some things that i have taken note of but overall um i'm very happy with my results um i think that it was definitely worth waiting the year to flat iron um so i am going to go ahead and um go through and just bump it a little bit just to give it a little bit more body and then i will be back with the final look so stay tuned okay be right back all right you guys i am back with the final look and i am so excited i think it turned out so beautiful i even feathered my bangs a little bit you know what i'm saying um but yeah guys so i am happy with my results i hope you enjoyed this video um, thank you guys so much for rocking with me um, until next time i am tiara b and i am out bye